Alright guys, how's it going? Today we're doing something a little bit different. We're going to be playing Until Dawn, the extended edition. So let's dive straight in and start a new story. The Butterfly Effect. So the way this game plays is any slight decision that you make differently each time you play through will drastically change this apparently anyway. So we'll see how we go on in this first playthrough. I may do a couple of different ones I guess. It all depends on how differently the story changes. But I like the premise, it should be good. So it's one of many possibilities. Nice little spooky cabin in the woods. And a creepy guy holding a machete outside, just what you want. Deserves it. Yet it's not her fault that she has a huge crush on my Hannah's been making the moves on him. I'm just looking out for my girl Em. <sighs> just because he's class prez doesn't mean he belongs to everyone. Mike is my man. Hey, Em. I'm not anybody's man. <laughs> Whatever you say, darling. Why is everyone hiding? Oh, she's here! Shh, shh, shh. Mike! Mike? It's Hannah. Hey, Hannah. Okay. Oh, so we're back to the creepy guy outside. Dad said it'd just be us this weekend. Josh. Okay, so we can finally move around. Let's see what these up to. This guy just passed out. Um, can't actually do anything. Let's see what this guy's doing. Is that a key? Alright, cool. There we go. Have a bottle. Jeremiah Crag. Jeez, Josh. <laughs> Once again, brother, you've outdone us mm. all. Let's see what this is. Hannah, you look so damn hot in that shirt. I bet you're even hotter out of it. Come to the guest room at 2 o'clock a.m. from Mike. Oh my god. What did our naive sister get herself into now? Let's find out. Got your note. Glad you can make it. Is that the guy from Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D.? I'm sure that's Ward. Start with a little, you know, making out and see where it goes from there. Uh-oh. What are you doing here? Ah, uh, 
Hannah. I'm sorry, Hannah. Hannah. Hey, this all got out of hand, just but... a stupid prank. Uh, hey. Oh, poor Hannah. Jerks. Check out the jerk with a selfie stick. Okay, so we can find the others or wake Josh. Uh, let's find the others. Josh ain't gonna do much. There's someone outside. What the hell? Hannah! What's going on? Where's my sister going? <sighs> it's fine. She just can't take a joke. It was just a prank, Han. What did you do? We just messing around, Beth. It wasn't serious. You jerks! Hannah! Hannah! So, should we go after her? You know, I kind of think you're the last person she wants to see right now, Mike. Some of the characters look so oh, real. Like, Hayden's character is amazing. <sighs> Quick time events. Fast or safe? Uh, I've already seen someone play through fast, so I'm going to go safe. Although usually I would take the fastest route possible. So let's see how this plays. I've got some footprints. Someone's been through here. Let's hope it's Hannah. Or is this Hannah? I don't actually know. Um, footprints or noise? Go footprints. I'm up some deal. Jesus, fuck. I thought they were actually going to attack her there. I'm sure they would if you run into them like that. Where are you? Oh, cool, so we can swipe the phone. Very iPhone like. Hannah! Let's see what we can find. What's the light coming from? Is that supposed to be moonlight? Another deer. Yeah, let's walk as fast as possible. That's not much faster, to be fair. Hello? Hello? That's normal. That's fast. Ooh, something on the ground. That's quite brutal. Death totem. Okay, so that is a prophecy of something that's going to happen, I guess. Oh, I should have inspected that. Try again. Okay, I can't inspect it. Let's leave it there. I'm probably in the menu. Something's going on over there. Hannah! Is that like a flamethrower? There's Hannah. someone. Hannah! Oh my god, you must be freezing. Here, take my coat. I'm such an idiot. I'm so dumb. Hannah? Something's coming. Make a run for it. 
run for your life. <laughs> Why do they always fall? Surely it's the one time you look where you're going. Oh, there goes the phone. Jesus Christ! Well, that was a bad no. decision. No. have to make a choice here. Hold on! Hold on! Is he gonna help her? He's reaching for her. He's gonna help her up, surely. Oh man, I, I, I've let go before. I'm, I'm gonna drop Hannah. So I feel sorry. bad. No! <laughs> what? My God. What a waste. I feel bad now. I shouldn't have dropped her. If I knew they were both going to die anyway. There are a few things I need to make sure you understand. You see, no one can change what happened last year. The past is beyond our control. You have to accept this in order to move forward. But there is freedom in this revelation. Everything you do, every decision you make from now on will open doors to the future. I want you to remember this. I want you to remember this as you play your game. Every single choice will affect your fate and the fate of this those This ain't a game. You. This is real life. It's real to me, damn it. So... You have committed to commence with this game. This is significant. And I want to help you see it through. Sometimes, sometimes these things can be a little scary, even terrifying, but I'm here to make sure that no matter how upsetting things may get, you will always find a way to work through it. Hmm? Is he talking All to me right. as a player? We will start with a simple exercise. Could you please pick up a card? And I want you to look at the picture on the other side and tell me what you feel about it. It, it is essential that you answer honestly in order to get the most out of this experience. What a creepy smile. Let's try the card. It's a farm. With a scarecrow. And. So, how did that picture make you feel? I thought it was going to be one of them ink blocks. Uh, it makes me happy. It doesn't really make us feel anything, really. In what way did it make you happy? It looks like a nice day. I'll go with the sunshine. <laughs> I see. So which word would best describe how you feel about darkness? Um I feel depressed. <laughs> well, winter nights are cold and dark. Depression, feelings of loneliness are not uncommon. This night in which your game takes place is particularly cold and dark. I would think that you might feel isolated at times. Does that bother you? No, I'll be fine. I'll be fine. Well, not much of a people's person, are we? Well, there's only me playing the game. It's single player. Well, it seems we have uncovered a significant topic to explore in our next session, but for now, we're out of time. Have fun on your own. Until then. <sighs> I shall look forward to it.
What a creepy guy. Creepy, creepy guy. It's probably him. He's the murderer. 